Good evening, fellow slash afternoon slash morning uh, YouTube Aryans. Oh. I'm Shay. Welcome to Shay Tucky and the Muse Rats it's cooking show. And today we're going to cook Lady Palmer's roast lamb with rosemary and garlic and all those other influenzas, you know. Influences? Yeah, what he said. Influenzas are flu. Yeah. You don't want that for lunch. Not recommended, no, no, no. We weren't even going to do this. We were going to cook a haggis, but neither of us knew how to do it. So we're going with the Lady Palmer roast. This is a house famous recipe. It's been handed down by generations to generation. How long has this been in the family? Six weeks. Well, <laughs> you know, it's all, heirlooms have to start somewhere, and every heirloom was, you know, some started off as a bargain somewhere. Who says that? I just did. Now, what you'll need is a leg of lamb. Ta da! Good job. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, we're going to have to uh, get a basting di roasting dish. We have a roasting dish here. Now what we're going to need is a bit of oil for that. We'll need some rosemary. If you can get some rosemary there ready. That'll be this uh, green flowery stuff. And what we do is we give this a bit of a basting. Give it a good basting up and down. Like this. Just throw some of that in the bottom. Beautiful. Then you're going to need some garlic. Get your garlic. Garlic out. You'll need your race page, the smasherator. Oh, <laughs> and you find your bits of garlic out. The rest is gone. Now you'll need a knife if you can sort of cut they get these up and cut them into slivers. You'll need slivers. How many are we going for? Six, seven, eight, or five. So while he's doing that, you need to put a few holes into your lamb. So we just give that a bit of a stabbing so that they can take the uh, garlic. How are we doing, brother? I've almost got one. <laughs> yeah, there's it. a few more of them. No worries. Your fellow rats will love them. If you can put the oven on to uh, 200, then put the kettle on. That's Celsius, yeah? Yeah. You have an international audience. Absolutely, bit of pepper. Kettle's on, full of water. Raise me on top. Now, you're all saying to yourselves, what a load of shit. This is how all roast lambs are done. Ah. Pretty much. But you didn't allow for the Lady Palmer trick. Now this is it. What you do is you pour hot water over the top of it and then while that's cooking in the oven, it'll also steam and keep it moist and beautiful. Pour that all over that without washing away too much rosemary. Hasn't quite cooked through yet. No, it needs a little bit longer. A, few, a, few, <laughs> a little a bit longer. Of those <laughs> Couple of kettles, a bit of a blowtorch. Look at that, marvellous. The meat on the side's sealing up a little bit there too. You see that? We meant to do that. <laughs> Might be something to this there. If you can open the oven, I shall place it in there. Oven's open. Still not quite on yet. Now, the, you basically cook it by how much it weighs. So if it weighs two kilos, you cook it for two hours. If it weighs a kilo and a half, you cook it for an hour and a half. So that one was a kilo, 330 grams. So that'd be an hour 33. And uh, yeah, check it and see if it needs a bit longer. You can always cook longer, but you can't uncook. So it's always to go a bit Makes early. Sense, yes. So now, what are we going to do for an hour and a half? One, two, three. Oh, Kevin got us on that one. Oh, what? Yeah. Two, a three. Oh, Shanina Mahedron, you little name minx. Oh, She's very good. Oh, oh no. One, two. Three. Three. Oh, Martha just snuck us out on that ah, one. God. Damn. We're not good. We're not very we good. Another game. another game, another game, another game. 
Lemon across. Um, toppings for meats. Five, five letters. Shit, we should know this one. What would you put on the meat? Sauce. 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 Sauce is five, yeah. Go sauce. Sauce, yeah. Yep. Eleven down. Ancient Scottish porridge daring stick. Sp sp spittle? Spurtle. Spoon? Spurtle, yeah. Uh, that, that fits, does it? Yeah, yeah, spurtle. Spurtle. What are the odds? <laughs> yeah. One of us should really learn how to edit. I know how to edit. You do? I do. All right, well, it's time now to check the roast. So I shall glove up, Ratty, if you could do the honours of opening the door, please, and pray to God this thing works, Lady Palmer. Here we go. No butt crack. Thank you very much. Oh, there you have it. Lovely! Look at that. It glistens, it shines. Now, Things to be eaten. You could need one of these, thank God I got ones. It's a thermometer, which will tell us if it's cooked or not. If you don't have a thermometer, you can bang in a skewer in the thick part, and if the juices run clear, then it's cooked. And this tells us she's cooked lovely. Beautiful. So if we can just wrap, we'll wrap it in foil for 10 minutes, see if we can get some foil there ready. Put that on, wrap it up. There we go, and we'll just leave that sit for 10 minutes. What are we gonna do for 10 minutes? Oh, edit man. Oh. Okay, bring her on, we'll give it a test here. Oh, look at that lovely jubblies. See how we go here. Oh yes, looks pretty good. P piece one is pretty good. Piece one's good. Rest of it's ratchet, but <laughs> get a fork. Don't and... show them the rest. No. no, no, get a fork and try that out, sir. Give it a whirl, shell. That's a big piece of lamb. That's <laughs> a big piece of lamb. Well, you're a big lad, so there you have it. We shall carve oh. that up and have a great meal. That's great. And if you do this, you have a good meal too. Speaking of that, has anybody actually tried any of these meals that we have done? Yeah, I'd like to know. We'd love to know in the comments below if anyone actually tasted any of this Which cuisine. One Yes. Hot dog in a kettle? Hot dog in a kettle. Hot pepper sauce? Any of those? Let us know in the comments below. But until then, I'm Shay Taki. I'm a new drunk. We'll see you at the bar. Daddy. -o. I have no idea. No, 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 no idea. You turn up the rehearsals, you know. I'll hit you again if you don't go to this here stupid thing. Come on. Yeah, still filming, still filming, still filming. Ah, we have rehearsals? No, we don't rehearse. Doesn't matter. We didn't rehearse that either. <laughs> there you go. Cut that bit out.